hello everyone welcome back today in this video i'm going to create the pagination of our post like we have a hard-coded pagination so how we can create the dynamic pagination based on our post so before this we are facing this issue that we enable to add this button on the second line so what's the issue so basically issue is it's understanding it also this is an html and it's binding it with this one right so how to get rid of this one because we are applying this here our reading is as html so we need to remove the spatial entities so let's go here um, and i google it that how to display this uh, like this so it's a uh, different question like that you need to do this like this but this is also not working for us that's why with the we are doing this another way so here you need to display this like this and then you need to decode this so HTML special entity right I'm going to do this with this one so here I'm going to add a helper of this HTML special decode and then I'm going to add this description into this HTML special character and here I'm choosing this one so now it's going to work for us Oh, I need to give it a refresh here, not there. Right, and yes, now it's uh, behaving like HTML and it's added on the next line. So this answer is working. So let's read this answer and remove, close this out. So now I'm going to click on this continue reading and open this into the new web page. And uh, yes, it's now loading and it's having a huge image with the description and uh, everything is working fine right they're displaying its date its category and its title and it looks awesome right okay so later we will also fix some issues like we want to display this uh, more width here i will display this till this one and i'm also going to fix this here that it's not displaying it properly right so I want to make this border radius so first let me do this and then I will work on the pagination so let's uh, go here we need to go to the auth and in the auth we are displaying the post here and I want to add this width and here I want to also add one more property I want to add this uh, border radius border radius and uh, I want to apply the border radius of 50% right save this one and let's get refresh okay it looks uh, nice but uh, not too much so now how to i think image uh, it's behaving like this because we have an image uh, which in width is uh, greater than its height so that's why it's behaving like this so i'm going to remove this out and uh, here i'm going to define its size and uh, height differently so define height i'm going to assign this 50px so let's give it a try <coughs> okay it looks like layer like this so let me make them same for both one maybe it looks nice okay and yes but it's not too much uh, nice but it's behaving like uh, it's good let me make them sim 70 so uh, they are displaying a very huge image <coughs> we are playing around these post and yes now it looks nice right and uh, <coughs> there is one more option i can instantly view it from uh, and this is for the administrator and i can also add an icon where i can instantly click on this post and you can view this here like this but uh, <coughs> you can add this uh, by your own functionality okay it's fixed and uh, now the time is to work on what's next i want to work on these images i want to display them full width okay so let's close this so index and basically this one is the website index where i'm displaying these post okay so why this image is not uh, doing properly so i added this width uh, 70 so let's uh, remove this width 
so it will auto adjust to according to the theme okay now it's behaving like good and it's so uh, its height is bigger that's why it's behaving like this so let me restrict it height mm, width and height so it will be around uh, nine i'm going to make this uh, 100 and uh, what's the height let me first do it and then i will set its height and 100 is like you know, it's good and uh, the height would be the <coughs> oops i added this width like this and here i'm going to add the height uh, i added this height to width without any style tag you can add this without any tag because uh, it's can image contain width and height without this one right so here I'm going to do this with the style so it's going to apply this more accurately 100% and the height would be the uh, it would be uh, how many percent I'm going to find this 70% let's get refresh mm, no <coughs> Uh, it's uh, not applying the height exact height which you want to do this I'm going to remove this height and uh, whenever you are uploading the images you need to take care about uh, this one because you need to apply the validation whenever user is uploading the image so you should ask that you need to apply the image dimension like width equal this one and height equal this one so then a user can't upload this type of image right so i already told you that how you can apply the validation on it uh, on the demand on the specific dimension so now it looks good and when i'm going to click on this so it's going to view its full image with the detail right so i'm going to go back and apply the pagination on it okay so this pagination is basically displaying here so i'm going to work on this pagination so for this pagination I'm going to go to this controller let's close this single one and here on the home page whenever i'm applying this get method so in the laravel the pagination is very simple so you need to just call the paginate and in the paginate you need to pass the entries how many records you want to paginate for now i'm going to add this one why i'm adding this one because i want to test this because i have two posts and it will display the first post on the first page and display the second post on the second page so that's why i added this one so you can add this five or ten so then user will view the ten post on the first page and then another on the next page so let's uh, get refresh and uh, this will now going to open only one post not second one because it's paginated so now question arises that how we can display the pagination so now you need to go to this uh, index and here i'm going to let me scroll them here and i'm going to make them comment here right and uh, here i'm going to display my pagination so let's uh, type my stretch sign and then call post remember you don't need to call this post because we are applying on the pagination on the plural so remember you need to add the uh, array right and then you need to call the uh, there are two methods the first one is links and second one is render which is render the pagination but links is uh, added in the laravel 8 and laravel 9 so this one is the latest one render is the old one which is used in the 4 5 6 and 7 and yes so this one is displaying our pagination like this right so let's uh, go here and call another method simple paginate to call the simple paginate i think it's uh, having the bootstrap issue that's why it's behaving image like this one so you can also customize this image so i already created uh, many videos on it that how to customize this and yes now these two button are added so i can instantly click on this next and then second page is open where i can view my second post and yes second post and now next is disabled because we don't have any post i can instantly view back 
so I can view the previous pagination right <coughs> so in this way you can create your pagination and if you want to customize the pagination which you are already displaying so you can also do this so I'm not going to do this here uh, because uh, <coughs> uh, I don't want to waste my time uh, waste your time so here I'm going to uh, share your, share a video with you where I created uh, almost two plus month ago where I'm explaining that uh, how this pagination is working and stuff like that you can also customize the pagination you can return the bootstrap 5 pagination turn the bootstrap 4 pagination and stuff like that career development lab this is my youtube channel name where i'm shooting different playlists so this is not my first uh, course i released uh, i already released uh, too many courses on my youtube channel especially on the laravel <coughs> let's open this out i have five four six videos which are a lot uh, and uh, you can check and out deploy laravel app on the server bootstrap dashboard with wheat wheat is uh, a set bundler which is added in the laravel 9.18 where uh, this one is wheat with the laravel where i explained that how you can add this in the Vue.js with the laravel react js live wire and jet uh, and uh, inertia and stuff like that uh, laravel design pattern where if you are building a bigger project so you can watch this series where i completely explain that how to structure your project if you are developing a too much bigger application <coughs> set up vs code so you can set up your vs code where you can add the namespace at the top automatically and also you can uh, play around different things you can visualize your icon blades icon and different uh, files icon you can instantly switch into the any of the files so there are much more things which are necessary for you and it will boost your development process laravel pdf series where you can learn it from scratch how to generate a simple pdf how to generate a bootstrap pdf how to generate the image pdf how to send this uh, into the email and this is laravel 9 course in urdu hindi you can watch this course <coughs> if you are a native speaker in urdu and hindi okay integrate admin dashboard where you can uh, learn that how you can integrate this dashboard laravel advanced series there are much more things full calendar is more popular where you can uh, add your calendar in your application and uh, get the booking on the page. so here our i'm going to set this out that uh, pagination yes pagination trips so here i have posted uh, different pagination that uh, and this one is about tips or level pagination how you can display the different pagination here i also add this pagination result pagination in laravel this one is in english we can watch this series how to show pagination number how to show the number pagination also display the view js pagination and there are much more things right so just search this pagination like this and these are all, all visible so i'm not going to display these uh, pagination and i'm going to remove them for now right so you can get this uh, you can uh, also add them by this style which is added in the theme okay so now <coughs> the time is to display these uh, latest post and these categories right so let me check the video size so our video size is uh, going bigger so i'm going to shoot this in the next video where i will uh, add this one and we will also fix some issues if we have so i will meet you in the next one bye bye guys